Good morning, friendies. Welcome back. Today is April 8th. Today is Wednesday. Let's get ready to stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. You do. Your grown-up will help you to find your right hand. Put your right hand on your heart. And let's say the pledge. Ready? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Great job, Brandies, you can have a seat. As I just said, welcome back. Today is, what's my flag doing? Today is Wednesday, April 8th, and I'm happy to see you today. It's a little cold and rainy and dreary where I am, but that's okay. It's still gonna be a great day, right? Let's jump right in. We're still talking about our letter A. Get up your sign for A. Five ah sounds, ready? Ah, ah, ah. Now switch hands, because remember, A says its name too. A, 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 A. Super job, friendly. So let's get right into our book today. I picked a pop-up book today. Do you like pop-up books? Me too. So I think you're going to like this book. The title of my book is The Color Monster, a pop-up book of feelings. And this is written by Anna Lanus. I don't see the name of the illustrator. So maybe Anna is the author and the illustrator. Let's say thank you to Anna for this great book. Thanks, Anna. Okay, friendies, are you ready? The Color Monster, a pop-up book of feelings. Feelings are how you feel in here. Sometimes it's happy, sometimes it's sad, angry, lonely. So let's see how this little color monster feels. Here's our title page, The Color Monster, a pop-up book of feelings. Okay, are you ready? Can you see him? Ooh. This is my friend, The Color Monster. Today he's feeling all mixed up, but he doesn't understand why. Did you ever feel all mixed up inside? Yeah, me too, and that's okay. Look at you, monster. You're a mess. Let's see how he's feeling. <gasps> Ooh. Look at that. You've jumbled up all your emotions and all your colors too. Oh, look at that. He's all jumbled up. I know. You can separate your feelings and put one each in its own jar. If you'd like, I can help you. Do you think she should help the color monster? Yes or no? I think so too. Let's see if she's gonna help him out. Oh, okay, Brandies, take a look. We're gonna try to guess how he's feeling. Look at the colors. Look at that. I see a birdie. And I see a little girl over here smiling. How do you think he's feeling? What do you think? Okay, let's see if you're right. This is happiness. It shines yellow like the sun and twinkles like the stars. When you're happy, you laugh and jump, dance and play. You wanna share that feeling with everyone. Is that true? When you're happy, do you wanna laugh and dance and play? Me too. I love that one. Ooh, friendies, okay, take a look. This one looks different, it's blue. And I see clouds and rain. Hmm, look at his face, he's sitting on the bed. What feeling do you think this is? Hmm, okay, let's see if you're right. This is sadness. It's gentle and blue, like a rainy day. When you're sad, you might wanna cry or be alone. Do you feel sad sometimes? Yeah, I do too, and that's okay. <gasps> I can't show you this. Too scary. You want me to show you? <laughs> what feeling do you think this is? It's red, and his eyes look big, and his you look sharp. What do you think? What feeling is this? Mm, this is anger. It's when you're mad. 
It blazes bright red. When you're angry, you want to stomp and roar and shout, it's not fair. Mm. I feel like that sometimes. Sometimes I feel like that because we have to stay inside a lot. And it's okay. It's okay to feel that way. Ooh, okay, now look at this one. I'm gonna open it up again so you can see it. This is fear. It hides in the black shadows. When you're afraid, you feel tiny and helpless. Fear makes it hard to be brave. Sometimes I feel fear too. Oh, look at this one. Oh, it's green and he's laying on a little hammock. Lots of leaves and flowers. What feeling do you think is this one? This one's tricky. This is calm. That's when your heart feels peaceful and at rest. It is as light as a green leaf floating in the wind. When you're calm, you breathe slowly and deeply and you feel at peace. Let's do a regular deep breath. All your feelings are in their places now. See, they're easier to understand when they're not all mixed together. Let's look at the sadness bottle. Whoop, yep, they're all bottled up. What was that again? Anger, let's see. Yep, he's got that all bottled up. Let's look at here, are those all bottled up? Come on, there we go. Yep, and happiness, all bottled up. I love that. Okay, last page. Oh, but wait, there's one feeling left over. What could it be? Freddy? So what do you think? It's pink and there's hearts around it. What feeling is that? Could you say L-O-B-E? It is love. Nice job. Let's touch your heart. Let's give a heart clap. Really nice job. Really nice job, ladies. I love that book. And you know what? It's okay to talk about your feelings. And it's okay to sometimes feel sad and then sometimes happy and sometimes angry. You just talk to a grown up and do some deep breaths and tell yourself that everything will be okay because it will be okay. Today is, ooh, there's our A word, April. When number is that again? It's an E. You're right. April 8th, 2020. There we go. Let's see how many gumballs we have. Do you think we can count to eight? Easy. We got this. Get your hands ready. Stop clock counting. I'm going to give you a like I'm brushing my teeth when you're ready. Here we go. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. What happened here? Oh my gosh. My gum bell fell off. Friendies, let's see what's supposed to go on here. Put your penny goggles on. Brrr, open them up. Let's see what color should be next. Ready? Purple, red, red. Purple, red, red. Purple, what's next? It is red. I gotta find my red. It was here a minute ago. I'll find it and I'll put it on there. Great job. Let's see what the weather's like. Where's it gonna land? Where's it gonna land? Where's it gonna land? Is it foggy where you are? It's a little foggy where I am. It's a little hard to see. Sunny. Is it sunny where you are? It's not sunny where I am today. Cloudy. Is it cloudy where you are? It's cloudy where I am today. Snowy? No. What, what, windy? It's not windy where I am today. It is rainy. Is it rainy where you are today? It's rainy and foggy and cloudy where I am today, but that's okay. It's still gonna be a great day. Is it Sunday? Nope, that's family time. Is it Monday? Nope. Tuesday? Mm -mm, it was yesterday. Is it Wednesday? It's Wednesday. Great job, friendies. Let's do our rhymes. Ready? Fan, pan, fan, 
pan, fan, pan. What's another word that rhymes with fan and pan? Tell your grown-up. Great job, great job. Okay, friendies, Tommy Thumbs Up is back again today. Put them up. Ready? Tommy Thumbs Up, Tommy Thumbs Down. Tommy Thumbs dancing all around the town. He's dancing on my shoulders. He's dancing on my head. He's dancing on my knees. Now, tuck him into bed. Who's next? Peter Pointer, ready? Peter Pointer up, Peter Pointer down. Peter Pointer dancing all around the town. He's dancing on my shoulders. He's dancing on my head. He's dancing on my knees. Now, tuck him into bed. The baby. Paula, she's gonna take a nap, so we gotta whisper. Paula Pinky up, Paula Pinky down. Paula Pinky dancing all around the town. She's dancing on my shoulders. She's dancing on my head. She's dancing on my knees. Now, tuck her in a bed. You ready for a party? All my fingers up, all my fingers down. All my fingers dancing all around the town. They're dancing on my shoulders. They're dancing on my head. They're dancing on my knees. Now, tuck them into bed. Tom's like, go to bed. Don't get up. Nice job. Give yourself a pat on the back. Super job. Okay, friendies, I have a couple things for you to do today with your grown-up, if you can. Grown-ups, I told you at the beginning of the week that we were going to do some activities with Easter eggs, so that's what we're going to do today. We're also going to play a little game with Hershey Kisses. Very soon, I'm sure there's going to be a lot of candy floating around your house from Easter. So this is a super fun game. And all you're going to do is you're going to write numbers. Can you see that? Numbers on the bottom of a Hershey Kiss. Then you're going to also write dots. So I just did one through five. So you're going to have the kids write, pick up a number. That's a number. There you go. Can you see it? There's a number three. And then they're going to try to find the number three. So they just turn them over until they can find the number three. Is this it? There it is. And remember our trick with counting? We're going to make our mouth match our finger. Touch each dot. One, two, three. You can go as high as you want. I would say try to get up to 10. But if you have some super counters, try up to 20. Okay, you're going to have plenty of candy. So if you don't do that today, maybe after Easter you can do that one. Here's another one with our Easter eggs. Okay, similar to our number match that we played the other day. This is a letter match. And all you do is you write capitals on the top of the egg. That portion's a little bigger, so it's easier. And then on the bottom, you're going to write the lowercase. Um, keep them the same color, obviously, unless you want to get really super tricky. And just have them stick their hand in. There's F. And then they're going to search for a capital and a lowercase. And they're going to match it up. Okay? So those are our games. I have another quickie game that you can play. It's called Tapping Sticks. It's like a song. I have these that I use at school, but you can absolutely use spatulas because they're wood, okay? And it's super easy. It goes like this. Listen while we tap our sticks, tap our sticks, tap our sticks. Listen while we tap our sticks. We'll tap them one time. One. And now, listen while we tap our sticks, Tap our sticks, tap our sticks. Listen while we tap our sticks. We'll tap them. What comes after one? Two. Two times. Down. Okay, so that's just a fun little game that you can play with spatulas. And now you've got the tune. Okay, little pick me up for the grown ups because they're doing a fabulous job. It is the wise mother who gives her child roots and wings. That's what you're all doing right now. Great job, grown ups. Grown -ups. Here we go. Ready, friendies? You say, I am brave. I am kind. I am smart. I am strong. Super job today, friendies. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you so much for joining me at Mrs. E's Chickadees, where every little chickadee is part of my flock. Have a great day.